Community Link, presented by Financial Center First Credit Union and 106.7 WTLC. Good morning, and thank you for joining us for this week's Community Link. I'm Caroline Mays Medley. Providing resources that will ensure residents can have a healthy life. That's part of the mission of the Indiana Minority Health Coalition. To tell us more is Carl Ellison and Vanessa Summers with the Indiana Minority Health Coalition. Welcome and thank you so much for joining us. Thank Thanks you for having us. Yeah, absolutely. So tell us what resources you provide to help residents have a healthy, productive life in Indiana. Well, the Indiana Minority Health Coalition, we've been around for about 25 years. Uh, we have a network of 22 local minority health coalitions. We do a great deal of health education. We do various uh, health improvement programs. We do research, we do advocacy. We do a lot of everything because uh, we're committed to reducing health disparities in the state. Absolutely, and so tell us what type of programs you do have. Well, one of the programs we have is National Diabetes Prevention Program. Mm -hmm. We know that there are 26 million diabetics, but there are 86 million pre-diabetics. Wow. And we are looking to find those people to help them uh, come, you know, get better. Right, absolutely. So I know maternal, mortal, mor maternal mortality is a major issue that you're focusing on. Why is that so important? Well, in Indiana, we know that 53 out of 100,000 women will die from just having a baby. I mean, from the time they have the baby till a year after, they have, they're in danger. We also know that as a black mother, you are four, three to four times more likely to die, just to die. Wow. So it's a very serious issue. And we know that it's being addressed all the way across the country, so. Okay. And, and when you add to that, Indiana <clears throat> has a significant problem with infant mortality. We're among the worst in the nation. But with, with respect to maternal mortality, Indiana's third worst out of all the wow. states. So okay. uh, it's a major health concern, and we want to focus on it. Yes, absolutely. So you do have an event coming up to focus on maternal mortality. Tell us about that event. When's it coming up, and what's, what are you doing at that event to educate people? We have an event coming up, it's uh, Black Maternal Mortality, Framing the Problem, Finding Solutions. We have a panel discussion that we're going to have, and thanks to you, you will be our moderator for that Thank day. You. And we will be talking to our health commissioner, Dr. Box. We have Judge Glenda Hatchett coming in. And we have another lady by the name of Arlene Geronimus that has done some some statistics and research on sy systemic bias in the healthcare system. So we're gonna be looking at those things, having a panel discussing, trying to find solutions to help the healthcare system help us. So I don't think people realize that there is bias in the healthcare system. Oh yes, right? yes, yeah. if, you're, <laughs> oh, yeah. if you're African American, they, they believe that your pain level is higher that you can just withstand more pain. Wow. And if you are a man, an African-American man, you will literally not get any help unless you're shot. Okay, wow, that's amazing. So what do you hope people will take away from the initiative that you're doing? Well, we always hope that the luncheon will provide some education, some information, but above all, inspiration because most of our health problems are preventable and can be solved at the community level. Some of it is what you choose from, from a lifestyle standpoint, but other parts of it is that we need to have a healthcare delivery system that's more culturally competent, more sensitive, and that in fact uh, works with us toward improving health outcomes. It doesn't make sense in America with one healthcare delivery system that African Americans should live less long than others, and so we're committed to trying to make sure that doesn't happen. Thank you so much. Thank you for all that you're doing. It's great work. Thank you. We really we'll see you it. soon. Yes, and we hope the community sees us as well yes. at that luncheon. And thank you so much for joining us for this week's Community Link. To share this segment or learn more about the Indiana Minority Health Coalition, head to wishtv.com.